What's up guys, Fahardy is here and welcome to today's video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make a villager generator. Yeah, that's that's what I call it, all right? So here's the idea. You have a mob spawner and imagine we have imaginary big mob spawner here and the mobs are gonna fall down inside this pit. And uh, as I always, we're coming down here and just kill them all, all right? So, uh, you need uh, to do two things, all right? As you can see, I have two livers. The first one is, uh, does this. Oh, oh, by the way, you actually need to wait until a zombie villager falls inside of the pit and then you're gonna do all this stuff, all right? Uh, first, you're gonna push this lever and it's gonna block the path so no more mobs are allowed anymore let me just uh, put some skeletons yeah they're all stuck there all right now the room is pretty secured then you're gonna kill um, a skeleton and the other zombie okay um, a little far all right let, let's see a uh, die a skeleton yeah, bone face. All right, they're dead. Now, when you kill them all, and only the zombie villager left, you're gonna pull this trigger. So what it does is, it's gonna push these two by two blocks up. Then it's gonna open up these doors, and then uh, this side is gonna push the zombie villager inside of this water. And he's gonna flows until he end up in this area. All right. So let's test it now. Let's see. Yeah, we only only have this guy. I'm gonna pull this trigger, and uh, yeah, sometimes he is stuck actually. But in survival mode, uh, you can just stand here, and he's gonna come for you. Oh, whoops! Sorry for the lag. All right, he's coming for us. And then he falls down. Dude, come on, man. Go down. Oh, all right, let's. All right, I got an idea. Just close this. In your face so this guy fall and by the way in this tunnel you put the water source here and uh, all right and uh, one more thing you need to learn is let me just make the time back to night make sure all right we need two blocks to push then uh, what we're doing let me just turn off the system so the redstone mechanics, this one on the top is a normal piston and two sticky pistons next to each other, right? And the first layer that goes to the normal piston is almost um, instantly. And the second layer is a little bit slower. As you can see, I set it on six ticks. And the last one is the slowest, so I put it on eight ticks. So when I... Um, pull the lever it's gonna push all these two blocks these two blocks are actually um, are actually these two blocks let's see let me just turn it off hold on are actually these two actually four blocks two by two blocks and uh, they're gonna push the zombie there and here is your taming area you can toss a potion of weakness to him and then feed him an apple and wait for a while and you're gonna have a villager this way and you can you know after he cured you can let them go and create your own village custom village out of it and sometimes you make you find a very good map and unfortunately you don't find any villages around so this way you can have villagers 
Guys, thanks for watching and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button and uh, subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe because every week we're going to have at least one Minecraft video, maybe more. So, see you next time.